reading friends. Welcome to the Happy Place to Grow. I am so glad you're meeting with me, Mrs. Davis, today to continue our very important work on sharpening our reading skills so that when we see new words, we know what to do. And we've discovered recently that practice makes permanent so the more that you study your words, work on them, see them, the more automatic the reading becomes and then you enjoy what you're reading. It's not a struggle. Now, we've been working with some new teams, beginning blends, and we found out that letter L loves to sneak in after a beginning sound, but they teamed together to create new words. We were also working with a, a, i, a, a, our short vowels so that we could create lots of different words using some beginning blends. Let's review those blends and then today's activity is going to be a quick one because we're going to be focusing on sorting our words but when we see them today's activity is not going to be sounding them out it's going to be looking taking those letter sounds quickly because we've already practiced them several times we're going to use our more quick reading skills and then we're going to sort them and become familiar with them because coming up after this lesson is our favorite spell check and I know you love that. All right, so let's review the beginning blends that we're going to be sorting reading words that we're going to read and sort today. GL, do you remember what G and L say together? We're going to hear both sounds, but they're going to flow. So G says G, L says L. Together they say GL. And you're going to be putting your tongue up on your teeth to get that. Hopefully you have some teeth. <laughs> you might be in the process of losing. That would make this activity a little challenging, but you can do it. GL. Say it with me. Mm -hmm. In our word flash today, we'll have some words with the blend ghoul. Now we have BL. So B says B. That's right. L says ol. Together, they say bl. Yeah, you have to stick your tongue out just a little further. Bl. Good job, you're doing great so far. Then we had FL, F says L says OOL. Put them together. CL team up too. What does C say? K, right. And L says OOL. We ought to be L experts by now, of course. Together they say cool. Mm -hmm. And then finally, in today's word reading sword activity, PL, P says, P. remember to make it quiet. P. L says, oh, together they team up and say, pull. Great. Now, let's get started. I know you can do this. We're advancing our word reading skills. Now, in your mind, you might still be sounding out the letters. That's okay. And if you look at the word and you don't get it right away, that's fine too, because that's what practicing is all about. Okay, I'm going to flash the word, give you just a second out there in the audience land, see if you can read it on your own, and then we're going to sort it under the headers with those beginning lines. Okay, here we go. 
first word up. This one has lots of letters. Five letters, but only four sound. Did you put full, a, sh, flash, right? Flash, like a flashlight or in a flash. We're doing this in a quick flash. And I'm putting it under full, flash. Okay, here's our next blend word. It's got four letters, four sounds. See if you can read it quickly. If you put plan together, you've got the word plan. Let's make a plan for a play date. All right, I'm gonna tilt that just a smidge because I don't have enough room in my chart for all these words. Lots of words with blends. Exciting. Here's the next one. CL, remember what that combo team makes. They're short I. The double F just says one sound. Did you say cliff? Cool if. Yes. When you get to the edge of a very steep hill or mountain, we call that a cliff. Hey, a person's name could be Cliff too. Like Clifford the Big Red Dog. Hey, cool. Multiple meanings. Here's our next one. Ah, there's that GL. Aren't you Glad you can read this word. Glad. Gful. They blend together. Glad. And we'll stick it right here. We're a little crowded, so we'll just tuck him up in there. Got glad, flash, cliff, plan. We are really moving forward. Here's the next one. F L again. And sure A, that's easy. Did you say flat? Oh, wow. Good job. Flat. Flat's going to go with flat. They both say full, full. They both have short A's, but the ending sound is different. I love how we can create new words by just changing one letter or two. Next one. CL. Cool. Ass. Did you say class? I love to go to school and be with my teacher in my class. If, they, if you are really, you know, on the ball and sharp, they say you've got a lot of class. You do things the right way. And I know you've got a lot of class. Okay, let's keep going. We're just getting warmed up. Full. Did you say flip? Flip is a turn. Flip, good job. Ooh, got a lot of blends and short vowels with full, flash, flat, flip. Here's a great one because we can use short U. We don't get to use that too often in our lesson with blends. PL, pull. Uh, g, plug, correct, plan, plug. Here's a good one. It's got five letters, but it only has four sounds. Because you know what CK in short vowel words, just one sound. Bull, a, k, black, correct. Oh, that's our first bull. So we've got glad, flat, what's this one? Flash, flat, flip, cliff, class, plan, and plug. Keep going, we have a few more. Remember, practice is helping us be more automatic. Uh-huh, cool. And then short O, and then these two say K. Clock. Tick tock around the clock. Let's put that with cliff, class, clock. And 
I love, even if we're not getting the words correct, it tells us that we still need some more practice. And we can make note cards at home and practice these blind words with our family, with our friends, with ourselves. We did have in one of our lessons where Y says I, and we had one blend. Fly, that's right. Good job remembering. That can be a motion. It can be you're going to fly. A bird can fly. It's an action. Or it can be that insect that drives us bananas in the spring and summer. Or a book character, fly guy. Next word is on deck. Mm -hmm. Rhymes with you. And there's a small word inside that. I love spying those, don't you? Did you say block? You are so awesome at this. Black and block. And look, all the letters are the same except the vowel's different. New vowel, new word. Let's keep going. We have just a few more. Yeah, pull, give, clip. Excellent. Let's put clip with clip, class, clock. Pack. I think we have just a few more. A couple more. This one's a fun one. Pull, ah. Plop. When you're tired, sometimes you just have to plop down on the couch and rest. Plan, plug, plop. That's quite the pool collection. Like, oh, this is a great one. FL, team together. Full flag. We talked about flag being a decorative uh, cloth. I have to stick that down where you can't see it, but you know it's there. That a design, sometimes it represents a country or city or state, or it's decorative. Or if you're waving somebody down like you're trying to flag down a taxi or flag someone down and you need their attention, you could do it that way. Because a flag, you know, it blows too. Two more. This is the next to the last. I like to experience this if I do something good. I like for people to give me a, a clap. Yay. You're doing great. You deserve a clap. And look what's hiding in clap. Lap. Very excellent. We've got clap, cliff, class, clock, cliff. Ooh. Same letters, one vowel change, new word. No wonder there's so many words to learn. It makes our job a little harder, but once we've got this code down, we can go to any book and read and enjoy. Last word of the day. GL, goal, at, glass. Be careful. The glass will break. Windows have glass panes. And we talked about this in our previous lesson, that glass can be something that you drink out of, but it's a material glass. Oh, look. In glue, there's just two short vowel blend, beginning blends with glue. You know, there's a lot more words that have blends but we're really focusing on the short vowel combos. So that's why some of our columns are just a bit limited. Wow, this is really fun. And I feel like we've gotten some good practice because the next challenge is our spell check. And I want you to join me for the next video because spelling is really important. And it's connected to reading. Once you know letters and sounds, you're thinking about the sequence, the order that the sounds that you're hearing go in, then when you're writing, spelling becomes 
really easy. There's definitely a connection. Spelling is probably the hardest part of this reading writing puzzle. So this practice is helping us because when we do spell check, we're going to be spelling these same words with blends. All right, I'm going to catch you on our next lesson. And while we're in between sessions here, go get your paper, go get your clipboard, get your pencil, your marker, whatever you're using to spell out these words. And I'll be ready and waiting for you. We've got this. All right. Thanks for reading so great today with me. I feel better about these blends and I know you do too. All right, see you real soon.